Sudan's military reinstates ousted civilian PM Hamdok. Sudan's ousted Prime Minister Abdullah Hamdok has been reinstated following last month's coup when he was put under house arrest. He has appeared on TV to sign a new power sharing agreement with coup leader Jan Abdel Fattah al Burhan amid continuing mass protest. The civilian coalition that nominated Mr. Homdog as PM two years ago has refused to acknowledge any new deal. The, the pact had been stuck with a gun to his head, a spokesperson told the BBC. The future of the country will be determined by the young people on the ground. Siddiq Abul Fawaz from the Forces Pro Freedom and Change FFC coalition told BBC's news or program. On the streets of capital Khartoum, the security forces have fired tear gas at protesters marching towards the presidential place and demanding the military's complete withdrawal from politics. Since 25 October, when the military declared a state of emergency and dissolved the civilian leadership, at least 40 people have died in mass protests against the coup. Mr. Hamdok was quoted by Reuters new agency as saying he had agreed to the deal to show up the violence. Sudanese blood is precious. Let us stop the bloodshed and direct the youth's energy into building the building and development.